It's a me, Sleeping Mario. So very softly. Shh, everybody. Mario's sleeping. You don't want to watch you wake him up. What the fuck was that? What, Mario? What? You fucking talking to me? Uh, I'm sorry, man. What? What? You want some of this? You want some of that? Oh my god! <laughs> Oh, he actually kind of ran up the screen, kind of intimidatingly there. And I expected the t camera to move as he did, but it didn't. It didn't happen. <laughs> Anyways, find the eight red coins. This is Super Mario 64. Everybody, oh my God, the way those red bombs turn at you very slowly is kind of terrifying, to be honest. So, something that will be a very common theme in these game levels is finding the eight red coins. It's not gonna work. Dang it. Oh no, oh come on. So, uh, a lot of people do the 100 coin mission and the find the 8 red coin missions at the same time. Uh, I don't think this one's actually possible at the moment actually. I'm pretty dang sure you gotta come back later. Many of you know why you gotta come back later, but I'm not gonna spoil it for those that don't know in this 20 year old game that everyone has played and or watched the Let's Play on. <laughs> you, need, you need a hat. There we go, that's that's a spoiler and inconspicuous for some reason. I don't freaking know. Oh, I gotta go to the, the hill that looks like it goes on forever. I'll do that in a moment, you guys. I mean, yeah, that, that was a weird description, I realized, but it's okay, it'll all make sense. Woo! Okay, yeah, third red coins on top of the islands. What does this say? This sign is, you need the wing cap! What is that mysterious thing that no one knows about? Ha 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 ha! So I'm trying to laugh. <laughs> if you look, like where the fence, you see where the fence above me ends. It looks like that hill just goes around a corner, doesn't it? And it just keeps going. But if you walk up to it, <gasps> it's a corner. No way! That that illusion didn't work out as well as I planned it to. Let's see if we can get a better shot of that. Like here, for example, it totally just looks like it just loops around like a mountain or something, doesn't it? But if yeah, if you just walk there, it doesn't. <laughs> it just stops. I don't know. I, I thought that was really cool when I discovered that. It's like an, an unintentional optical illusion. So I feel like I feel like there's a lot of clutter on the screen right now. I don't really know why. Ah, the chain chomp. Thankfully, I feel like that's something that should instantly kill you, but he doesn't. He's too nice for that. What a lovely little chainy chompy. I think there's two red coins over here, oddly enough. And wow, this fence is huge, man. Jeez. Most bob barbed wire fence, bob wired fences. <laughs> Most barbed wire fences are only like, I don't know, up to like your shoulder height for like a normal sized person. But this is like freaking towering over Mario. Weird. I believe we're almost done with the red coins. Ready! Is there one over here? I, this is where I get a bit mixed up later to the level. Bling bling. Let's go down here. Oh look, it's a secret coin and a secret one up. Except it's not very secret because it's mandatory. Yeah, for men because it's mandatory. Oh, what the heck happened there? Holy crap, I didn't mean to go back down here. I like let go of the control stick and Mario started going downhill for some reason. I mean, it kind of makes sense, but it's still confusing. <clears throat> All right, I believe a rumor has told me Stop that. Oh my good lord. Apparently- Oh stop! No! If you crouch down, you can crawl up ledges like this. Let's see if that works. My rumor- I heard a rumor. I mean, I heard this a long time ago, but I don't think I ever tried it. Okay, you can, but it takes freaking hours. Oh man, I almost would. I almost just said screw it. I'll go the normal way. We're almost there. We're so close. So yeah, this isn't the only way to get this coin. You could go up the mountain a little bit, and you could see it as you go up the mountain. You could just slide down from the top. Yay! You see where the ball's rolling there. It's very clear. It's not like even a hidden path. Should we just go all the way up at this point? Probably not. This is really stupid. Come on! Ah, oh, crap! I thought maybe I could make it up. Jeez, holy crap! We got a freaking long way. It's not as slow as I thought it was. Yeah, it's very clear. I'm not gonna even show because I'm a horrible let's play. Whoa! Okay, I thought that fence opened up there, but nope. It's right here. No! 
Let's go over here. Oh god. Okay. So yeah, you'll see this little you'll see the shadow of the star and then you'll see like this weird silhouette of the star on the ground spinning slower than the actual star. That just tells you where the red star red coin stars are gonna pop up since they show up in special places when you get them in every single level. But yeah, red coins, but the time runs out, good luck. Josh Jepson reference. Alright, let's head back in. Mario winks to the sky. Gosh dang it. So we actually can't do this one. But uh, what we can do is another one. And that has to do with the chain leech hall. I didn't realize that was a fifth mission in here. So we can actually save this chain chomp from. Oh, come on. I'm gonna probably die, actually. Okay, we might be okay. <laughs> Whew, I'm surprised I was able to hit the peg three times before he attacked me once. That's very rare. I only hit it twice or once before he attacks you. So yeah, he just, he just face plants into that mountain for some reason, and that's good times for him. I don't freaking know. Whatever. He also broke this in the process, so let's go get the freaking cage star sprite strip and be happy days forever. Yay! We shall save and continue. All right, here we go. Oh wait, I guess we can't even do this one. <laughs> okay, so there's actually six mish six main stars in every world. Oops. Oh, I pressed B thinking it would escape the course, but it did not escape the course. We've done all we can in there for now. We'll come back eventually. What the heck? I just walked into that, man. Normally you just do that weird pushing animation. You don't fall back like that. Anyways, we'll go across the room here. we go to the one star room. Look at that emotionless star that only has eyes and nothing else. Imagine having only eyes. No nose to smell, no mouth to speak, no ears to hear. Just eyes. Wouldn't that be crazy? Chip off Womps Block or any sense to be honest. O o like, what if you could only smell and you couldn't hear? Well, whatever, that's weird, man. Hello, Lakitu brother. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Hello, Lakitu bros, cutting in with a live update of Mario's progress. He's about to learn a technique on sneak up on enemies. The trick is this he has to walk very slowly in order to walk quietly. Wow. Wow. When you can't move the camera any farther, buzzer will sound. Yeah, yeah. I already explained that last episode. So yeah, when he lock, walks slower, apparently he makes you walk more quietly. Isn't that weird? So it's excellent to kill freaking plants. Oh no, I didn't. I, I okay. I, I walked fast, too fast. So you need to do that, or you could just freaking dive bomb them before they wake up. But you can't hurt them when they're awake for some reason. It's weird. There we go. That's what I normally do. I just dive at them. Maybe that's a blue coin. I think that's the first time I've seen that. It gives you five coins. Also. I think you guys could probably see this. You could see where the lines end for like the for the literal blocks they use in this level very easily. He drew back? Weird. Normally you have to walk farther away than that. But you like see the block ends here and then like this this angled block and then there's this block and then there's this block. Isn't that weird? Hopefully that's picking up on the capture. I think it maybe is. <laughs> okay, so much like every Mission. First mission in the level. Oh, good lord. Oh, good lord. Huh. Okay, that was a little bit scary. A little bit scary, Miss Carrie. Much like every first mission in the world, you pretty much the basis of the level is get to the top or get to the end to get the star. Oh, man, this plants die so sadly, you know. <laughs> sadly. Eh. Okay. Ah, I should have known. Should have known that would happen to me. How can this happen to me? We're already one fifth of the way to collecting the hundred coin star. Which is weird. Which I, that is a thing in these games, by the way. BT dubs. If I didn't already say that, I might have already said that. I don't freaking know. Uh oh. Uh. Eh. I think these guys actually blow fire at you too. No, they don't. Maybe they blow fire you just eventually. Anyways, jump across that wooden spoon. That's what it looks like. These guys are freaking terrifying, aren't they? And easy. Yeah, punks. I sure punk you, punk kids. I'm just gonna run past this guy because who really cares about him? Oh, uh, what? How did I fall off that? Okay, there we go. Look. Oh my god. <laughs> 
It makes me so mad! We build your houses, your castles, we pave your roads, and you still walk all over us! Do you ever say thank you? No! Well, you're not going to wipe your feet on me! I think I'll crush you just for fun! Don't you have a problem with that? Just try to pound me, wimp! Ha! <laughs> ah, what a loser. What? I tried to do backflip there, but it didn't work. Okay, so, oh wow, I was gonna say, it's very forgiving, but apparently not. This weird, like, bulbous hands. It's weird, man. So, when I say I've recorded, tried to record this Let's Play four times already... Whoa, I almost died there. I don't mean, like, I recorded one part and called it quits. I believe the farthest I got was, like, part eight, and then I called it quits. Which is a weird leg to, like, be like, okay, I, I don't like this, I'm gonna start over. But I think the first time I recorded, I recorded, like, four or five. And the second time, I was like, eh. I don't remember what... Uh, is it, did I count this as the fourth time? I'm pretty sure this is the fourth time. No! No! An epic no from Chugga Conroy would say. <laughs> Crest again! I'm just a stepping stone after all. I won't gravel, er, gravel. Here you win, take this with you. You know, I kind of gotta agree with this guy. I feel kind of bad for him. He built, he's a freaking builder and we killed him for helping people build castles and junk. What the heck, Mario? What a dinkleberry pie. Dinkleberry pie! <laughs> uh, chip off of Womp's block. Disgusting. Wow. 30 coins. Almost one third. Alright. To the top of the fortress. Okay. So we're literally doing the same freaking thing we just did two seconds ago. Okay, that's definitely where you could tell they struggled a bit with this in creating this game. <laughs> Is making new level. Or making, like. They already ran out of ideas on the second store for this place. Oh god! <laughs> oh Jesus! But uh, yeah, it's it's just strange because it's like the second level is doing the exact same thing we did in the first level. Which is strange, but okay. Uh, I'm happy this one spoon stops in the middle there. No! No! Is this gonna kill me? Whoa! That fence saves me all the time. Okay, I believe that we actually talked. Oh, hello? I thought there was supposed to be a bomb on here. <clears throat> Maybe it doesn't show up till later. I was hoping I'd just be able to talk to him and he could just shoot me to the top, but no, apparently not. <clears throat> I've been rejected! Poor me, ripping pieces. Alright. Please make that. Yeah! Weird, I crouched down there when I landed. Might be my controller glitching out. So yeah, our second mission. Get to the top. Uh, again. <laughs> what? Okay, so he killed freaking Womp. <clears throat> and he... He responded by continuing to build, even though he said he's pretty much sick of building. Interesting choice he got there, Womp. That is his name, right? That might be... I think it's Womp. Oh, okay. Wow, I'm surprised I made it up this tower this easily. Aha, sneaky star. But for some reason, I always think the star's gonna be on the top, the very tippy top of this little tower here. It's like a little freaking princess tower with a very, very small room at the top. Jeez, man, you gotta like... Can't even open up your arms or anything in that room. You just gotta keep them by your side. <laughs> hmm. I always get confused looking... Oh, 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 okay, okay. You know what? I always thought, like, the part where the tower is and all that, I always thought that was, like, a part, a floating island, and then where all these, like, green foresty stuff is. I always thought that was a different island as well. Like, they're both disconnected from each other in painting. But no, the gray and the blue is water and, like, the stony parts. Wow, I never noticed that before. That's crazy. I mean, that might just be me. But to me, it just looks like the blue looks like part of the sky, and I don't know, the stone just looks like clouds, to be honest. Huh. I wonder if I'm alone in that. Forever alone. Shoot to the wild blue. Uh... Okay, I think I know which star that one is, because there's actually two stars you get from using the cannon and shooting. But shoot into the wild blue, that does sound like shooting to the sky, doesn't it? There you are, why weren't you here last time, butthead? Butthead. Hi, I'll prepare the cannon for you. So, how these cannons mostly work, 
well, when I say mostly, I mean how they all work. Whoa, did you see that cannon appeared? Ready for the blast off? Come on, hop into the cannon. Is you gotta talk to them in each level. And when you talk to them, it only unlocks in that level. So, like, you know, when you talk to Bob on Battlefield, it didn't unlock it in this level, obviously. But, uh, once you talk to them, it's unlocked for all levels, even if we went back to, like, the first star. Jeez, work. Okay, I always have issues with that. Probably because I've done this, like, the fourth time I've done this in the past, like, month or so. <laughs> Ugh. Here we go! Into the wild blue. But yeah, so, um, what was I saying? Yeah. You will cover any of the power stairs, and now you can open the door with the big star, but Bowser is just ahead. Can you hear the princess calling? Mario, I hate you! Damn it! One day she'll love me! Red coins on the floating aisle. It's weird they say that, because most red coins aren't on the floating aisle. Jesus, game, and it's lies. It's lies to me. Ah, the butterflies follow you! That's cute. Adorable. And these walls are also not adorable. They're kind of creepy, to be honest. I was going to say they were adorable! You're adorable! <laughs> so the way I died at that level just sounded so flamboyant, I suppose. Secret sip of my drink that you guys definitely didn't catch. <clears throat> Anyways, let's go get the red coins. And not have issues with these stupid... I always find obstacles like that push you in games to be very 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 easy to avoid and that's not like just any games in particular but every single game ever I, I didn't mean to emphasize the ever so much but I almost died so I felt the need to emphasize it because I was scared <laughs> okay I always have issue with this one because you slip off a stupid fat head I love the sound they make it's so dumb <laughs> there we go Apparently, <laughs> apparently, just don't move. Three, four. Ah, ah damn! Holy crap! Mario made two screams at the same time. Poor Mario! Oh no! Oh no! Okay, probably could have made that jump, but let's play it safe. Stay alert. Stay safe. On this wooden spoon that's floating for some reason. I don't understand why, like, video games make things floating for. I mean, it wouldn't really been so hard to make something just, I don't know, attaching. Ah, oh, come on! Would have been really so... Ah, come on! I'm so close, man! Ah, it's always... It's always very scary. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, I feel comfortable with that. Let's jump back in this cannon and not fly to my death. Right, game? Right. Oh man, this might end very badly. Very badly indeed. Oh, oh, oh! I totally probably should have died there, maybe. I'll try it again. <laughs> okay, that's always scary too. Trying to jump into the cannon. So I was feeling like I was gonna jump right off the level, which is definitely a thing. And you can't really just walk. Oh, every time, man. Oh, we can't even go up this way. We only go down. What? That was a waste of time. Waste of time, magic. Ah. My head just got itchy as if a mosquito was biting me. But there was no mosquito. There is no spoon. Bling, bling, bling. Okay. Let's head back up. This time with rapid succession. I wonder if you should make the jump over. No. Maybe. Doubtful. <laughs> I may be doubtful. Eh. Bad, bad idea, bad idea, damn it! Okay, there we go. Whew. I totally didn't forget to start talking right there or anything. No, don't be redonkadonk. Ah, so I have six red coins, right? It's actually easy to see. It's weird they don't just give you a number. They just display how many red coins you have on the screen. So, coins on the floating island, right? Red coins on the floating aisles. It's weird, it didn't make it sound like it's gonna be a lot, but there's only two. Apparently. There we go. So we gotta kick down that ball. I actually really like the animation for it when it starts to wobble. I don't know why, it's just weird, just one of those things. I, mean, I always thought it looked cool. For no real discernible reason. <gasps> Are you serious? Come on, man. That was dumb. Mamma mia. Oh my god, are you fucking serious? Yeah. 
What? Fuck you! Okay, try this again. Oh, look at that satisfying rickety rockety. Even though the shadow like clips through the ground. Why isn't it working anymore? There we go. Okay, so crossing narrow ledges in this game can be a bit of the pain of the pain. I don't know why I said the for, but uh. Not because it's like, oh, it's hard to get across the ledges, but just because of the freaking camera, man. You can't line the camera up. It's the worst. You're out of 10. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Okay, I only dived there because I didn't think I was going to make that jump. You can just long jump here, thankfully. And thankfully, I didn't ground pound by accident. That would have been unfortunate. All right, now, oh, God. Now let's do this. Oh, God. Okay. Now let's do this. Please don't miss. Ah! Always a very terrifying jump to make. You don't obviously don't have to do that, but I find it fun. <laughs> okay. Here we go, everybody. Guess I'll call it episode here. Oh, wow, almost 50 coins there. That's crazy. It's always funny to me when you unintentionally almost get the 100 coins turn. I mean, I obviously didn't almost get it, but... You know, considering I wasn't even going for coins, I got a lot of coins. What the heck? was a secret, almost invisible toad over here. Translucent toad. It was Bowser who stole the stars! No way! <laughs> Send six stars in each coin course. You need cap switches. If you want to see the enemies are defeated, select like stars you've recovered them from. You don't get all stars from enemies though. Jeez, Toad, learn your junk. Anyways, uh, if you enjoy my stuff, the best way to support me is to leave is by leaving likes and subscribings to my channels. So if you do that, I would love you so very much. Yeah. Um, if you want to see me play a particular game, the best way to do that is by checking out the first link in my description, which leads you to a video where I ask you to leave game suggestions for me. The ones I get more suggestions on, I will consider and take a look at and potentially play. So thank you guys so much for watching. In the next episode, we'll finish off Wom's Fortress and then start the next level. Bye bye